Tiger Woods didn't have a great four-day tournament, and he had a post-game press conference as he got a lot of questions about the Ryder Cup team. One of the questions uh, from one of the journalists was uh, about Tiger Woods' view on President Trump. Now, you might have thought you know, it would open up for a rant like what came from LeBron James, but not from Tiger Woods, right. who says he's had a uh, known uh, Donald Trump for 20 years, and they played golf a short time ago. Dare I say they like each other. Listen to Tiger Woods handle this question. He's the president of the United States, and you have to respect the, the, the office. And no matter who's in the office, um, you may like, dislike um, the personality or the, the politics, uh, but we all must respect the office. Do you have anything more broadly to say about the state, I guess, the discourse of race relations? Um... No, I just finished 72 holes and really hungry. I don't blame him. <laughs> so the setup question was he was asked about his relationship with Donald Trump. Was it professional or personal? And that's why. He gave the answer he did. Uh, just like Jack Nicholas and Arnold Palmer and Gary Player and Phil Mickelson uh, down at Trump Doral in Miami, I just read, Tiger Woods has a villa named after him. Wow. An homage by Donald Trump. And there you can see one of the images of them. I believe that is at Mar-a-Lago. Well, you know if you're an athlete, if you're a celebrity, if you um, are even neutral on Donald Trump, um, that's a really, you know, tough question because you know you're going to get blowback from Hollywood, from other celebrities, from the media. Uh, so I, I think he handled it very respectfully. Were, I, I, right. I thought it was very well done. Because they, the, the, the reporter was asking, is he your friend or did you play with him because he's president? Essentially, yeah. that's the question. And the other news is Jim Brown said it on Hard Knocks and said it again. I voted for the president once. I'm going to vote for him again in 2020. I know that doesn't make me uh, very popular with the black community, but I don't care.